Okay, so this video is for talking about uh, accuracy in the context of uh, the data analysis control assessment task. So what is accuracy? Well, it's how close the measurement is to the true value. Uh, the trouble is that we, we never really know exactly what the true value of a, of a measurement should be. So one way to look at it is if you look at the graph of the points that you've plotted, uh, do the points lie near the line or curve of best fit? And if that's the case, it suggests that the results are accurate because we can see a nice trend. So on the left hand side here we've got uh, the plotted points and the red range bars okay, and uh, a line of best fit and the line of best fit can easily go through all of the range bars. So it's a curve of best fit, doesn't matter if it's a straight line or a curve. One smooth curve goes through all the range bars and near the points. So we say that, um, that those results are probably quite accurate. And if we look at the graph on the right we see a similar sort of trend but uh, this time, the line of best fit, the curve of best fit, it's not possible to have a nice smooth curve that goes through all of the range bars. You can see it misses the second range bar and the third one and the fifth one, just about sort of skims the bottom of it. So we generally tend to say that those results are less accurate or inaccurate, as a smooth curve cannot be made to pass through all the range bars. We could do it, but we'd have to have the curve wiggle up and down, uh, and that wouldn't therefore count as a smooth curve. Okay, so um, time for you to decide whether or not you're happy with this. Uh, pause the video, look at these four graphs below, and see whether you think the points that are plotted represent accurate or, or inaccurate results, and more importantly, can you explain why? And we'll go through the answers in a sec. Okay, so let's have a look at these then. Well, graph number one, uh, I won't say is accurate, because if you look, you can put a nice straight line of best fit through... Uh, very close to the points through the range bars so we all the points lie close to the line of best fit so it's accurate number two well it's a curve this time but still it's one smooth curve goes through all the range bars and fairly close to the points so again we'd say accurate for number three well it's a downward sloping line and and if you if you play around with it you, you can kind of mess the line about and get through some of the range bars but you can't really get through all of them uh, with a straight line or with a curve, okay, because the points are either side of the line and not close enough that you could do that. And we're, we're completely missing the range bar for the third point here and just missing the one for the fifth point as well. So we'd say that those results are probably inaccurate. And the number four, yes, it's an unusual trend, certainly, um, to be to go up and then down again, but um, it is still a smooth curve. We can put through those points, okay. So you would still say that those are accurate, even though the trend is slightly unusual. So hopefully that's helped you uh, with accuracy. Do watch the other videos uh, to make sure you're happy with the other terms that you need to use for your data analysis.